Oh my goodness, you didn't have to stand, but I'm glad you did. <laughs> um, this, is, this is unbelievable. Um, I'm truly, truly humbled, and um, for those who know me really well, I think they believe me because uh, I'm donning the same hairdo that I had when I was a gymnast. <laughs> so, <laughs> um, it was, it's funny actually when you think about receiving a Hall of Fame award for gymnastics. I mean, it's such a difficult sport that uh, I find it ironic that they give Hall of Fame awards to people that have made a career out of, for the most part, falling for a living for the majority of their career. <laughs> <laughs> but, in, but in all seriousness, um, you know, I had some time to think about what this meant to me um, months ago when I found out I was getting inducted and, you know, it, what I realized was that any success that I've ever had in gymnastics, any triumphs, have only been borrowed from the benevolence and the sacrifices of everyone that's involved in the gymnastics family. There's nothing that I could have done alone, that's for sure. I mean, whether it was having role models like Peter Vidmar, having amazing coaches, one that was practically a dad to me, like Tim Irwin, uh, even Vitaly Mar uh, Mar yeah, Vitaly Marinich, I almost said Sherbo. <laughs> but uh, coming over from Russia, I mean, when you think about all the things that, that uh, this family does together, and uh, my sister who selflessly drove me to practice every single day, my mom who would have practically done anything to see her son realize his dream, and who subsequently is probably more popular in gymnastics than I am. <laughs> But there's, there's no way I could stand up here and thank everyone. I am sure I have borrowed from the goodwill of just about everyone in this room. And I am truly humbled. And in closing, I'd like to say that the hardest accomplishment or feat that I ever completed in gymnastics was retiring. And it was very hard on me. And uh, this award it allows me to feel in my heart like I never really truly have to retire. I am eternally grateful. Thank you so much.